got me up all night. Hey right, guys, welcome back. I just need to uh, clean my entire hand of nude. Well, let's jump right into it. This is going to be um, new products that I have. New, it's just going to be like a haul of new stuff that I've gotten in the last month. Um, I did have my 25th birthday last week, um, so I have like a few more gifts, um, and then I got gift cards, so I went and purchased things with my gift cards. Uh, what else? Um, I got a Target gift card also for my dad that came after my birthday, so that's why. I have a bunch of new things, so everything's either from Target, Macy's, Mac, or Sephora. I think I covered everything. So any one of those. So the um, first thing I'm going to talk about is um, this Vince Camuto, Camuto uh, Fiori lip lipstick. <laughs> I'm traumatized. I just spoke about the hundred lipsticks. This is a perfume that my mom got me for my birthday, and it's absolutely beautiful. It looks amazing. It's so cute. Um, it's like a definitely like a rose gold it looks kind of like my watch but a little like more pinky rose gold color and it smells like heaven if you know me I have a really bad sense of smell I can't smell anything let alone pick out my own perfume because I have t like I can't smell anything like you could smell like so you can have the worst BO in the world and I won't be able to smell you. It's really, really bad. But um, te like usually like when I need a new like perfume, I'm kind of like, I tell my sister, hey Sally, can you help me pick out a perfume? Something that smells really good. Or I tell my mom or usually around my birthday or Christmas, I'm kind of like, hey, I'm running low. Can you guys get me a perfume for the holiday or whatever? Because um, I can't choose my own. So, lucky you guys, I could smell, but a lot of people have told me that it's kind of awesome that I can't smell because there's a lot of things that people wish they could never smell and I don't smell them. So just a little fun fact about me. So yeah, this is um, a perfume I got and it came in like a cute little package, but I threw it away. Um, but I absolutely love it. The next one is a Michael Kors bag. I got my first official Michael Kors bag, um, also for my parents for my birthday. Um, they went all out. It's my 25th birthday and they literally went all out. But I think it had to do a little with me having surgery and being 25 and just kind of like, oh, let's go ham on our daughter, which I appreciate, uh, completely. But, um, yeah, they went a little too far and I got my first Michael Kors bag. It's like one of those, uh, you can wear it as a, a side bag, but I don't like it. I like wearing it just like on my one shoulder. I wear it with a blazer and it looks so elegant, so nice, so 25. So just very age appropriate. I love how mature it looks. It fits a lot in here. Um, it's, you can see how um, wide it is. Um, it has little gold accentuates or gold whatever zippers and yeah that's the space inside and it just looks so clean and crisp and adult and I love it it's amazing and it's not an everyday bag well at least not for me so next um I got this as part of my hundred dollar um gift card that my dad got me for Target and I got a laptop cooling pad from Belkin it's just um, just a laptop. It comes with a little like USB thing that connects straight to like your laptop, so it, the fan starts working. Um, since I do edit all these videos myself, and I will always be browsing the internet um, on my bed or wherever I am, it's it's perfect um, on your lap, as you see in this picture. And it keeps my computer cool. I hate when my laptop gets hot on my lap. It's like the worst. Not everything in here is Mac, but I put everything in this Mac bag because I have like four Mac bags running around since I've been buying a lot of stuff lately. And I'm like, let me put some use into these bags. All right, so first, um, first thing I'm going to talk about is, um, or not the first thing, the next thing is I got this at Target as well. It's a Targus lens cap keeper. Um, and this is gonna be going on my Sony um, camera that I use to take 
the really nice high quality pictures now i'm like if i lose my sony cap i'm gonna be pissed so i actually found this it's like a oh like i said lens cap keeper you like it'll like attach to the cap and then you just kind of hate leave it hanging on your camera so it's always going to be hanging it's never you're never going to have to stick it in your pocket or stick it like it back in the case or leave leave it somewhere so you, like in your purse and it's just going to get lost if it's not attached to the camera so basically i bought an attachment for it to stay on the sony while i'm using the sony so i will never lose it and i it was really it was really inexpensive like three and change and i still haven't put it on but um I definitely will so um well like everyday products that i got um i try i'm in the process of trying to whiten my teeth i've never whitened them so i'm 25 of course they're not going to look pearly white even though i brush my teeth um so now that i'm more i'm getting more into skin and like teeth and everything so um i bought the crest 3d um white uh, toothpaste and now to go with that I got the Crest 3D white um, glamorous white uh, what is this called rinse I used it and it feels weird I don't know if that's what the whitening like stuff that's in it but it's more thicker and I got a backup oil-free acne stress control toner um, I love this for after I clean my skin with any clean any cleanser that I use um, I'm really oily I don't know if I'm oily right now because I've been sitting here but um I shouldn't be uh, it's, it hasn't even been like an hour that I've had makeup on or it has been over an hour but um, I'm very oily and I try to use a lot of oil free products um, to like try to help that and this does help and I like that it has like acne stuff in it because I used to suffer from really bad acne and actually I have a little bit of like I get the undergrown like pimple situations so um and also when it's that time of month I break out really bad I'll have like two really bad planets on my face and this just keeps everything a little more under control and I really like how it feels I feel like it's actually doing something and it also says it eliminates oil and shine so like that love it it was on sale that's why I grabbed it next from Target I got a deodorant um it's my first non-aluminum deodorant i've never i never ever knew that there was a um i never knew that there was aluminum in deodorant and when i found out i was like oh my god why are we putting aluminum in our like on our skin i don't think that's healthy i'm never going back to aluminum so rest in peace secret and ban all the ones that i used to use so now i'm trying this one toms of maine and i got it at target and it smells naturally dry it doesn't or natural powder but it's a naturally dry deodorant for women it was like four something sally what you threw up oh <laughs> what think fast uh, ah! Oh my god! My birch box is here! Where was it? At the door or in the mailbox? I just checked the mail. Wow, the mail came early today? Oh my gosh. My birch box is here! My friend Myra, she got me this for my birthday. As a present, she got me the six month subscription. I got Pixie, um, endless silky eye pen and this is like really good for um highlighting uh like the cupid's bow yeah. i guess down your nose you can do it on your cheeks but i haven't done it for that i mainly use it in my waterline this is the only color i like on my waterline i don't like white on my waterline i don't like nude on my waterline it makes me look really weird but this one is like amazing and it stays on forever like I will leave this on and once it sets and dries which it does quickly it will be on my hand until later tomorrow because I it just does not come off so I like that also for like the inner tear ducts um to just lighten it and um yeah this is great it was $15 but it's well worth it 
just a little too expensive. I got um, an Eco Tools uh, brush to touch up my makeup um, when I'm at work. I like having this, it's really convenient, easy, and it's my first Eco Tools brush, and I really do like it to touch up on my oily skin. Next, I got at Sephora is I'm talking fast because I have like no memory. Um, next is my I got this at Sephora for my sister's um, gift card that she gave me. I got a NARS concealer in colored custard, um, medium one, and I'm wearing it right now. And it's um, extremely creamy. It's called Radiant Creamy Concealer. Um, it's very creamy. It's uh, very nice to blend out, and it's. Um, like the perfect color for me to like brighten under the eye. It's my first concealer I've ever bought in. Um, I don't wear concealers, but I really like how it makes my eyes look. And so I definitely wear concealer every day now. Highly suggest it. Really nice. There's like six, seven colors. Whew! And I love it. MAC blending brush that I got at MAC. It's the 217. It's this one and the 224, I think it's called. The other the black one they're amazing for blending out this one's more for like like packing on color and blending out like like right in the outer corner so I really like this I'm still getting used to it I know how to work the black one better than this one but um I'm really enjoying it uh, next is a Michael Kors phone case that my sister got me um, that's how my phone is caseless because this is what I'm wearing she just got this I think at Macy's and um, she said it can match my watch and my bag and my obsession. So, yeah. Um, thanks, Sally. I love that. Um, then I got this. This is the case for this. Um, I got the acne spot treatment from Clean and Clear. It just, like, it has a really nice fine point. So, you just, like, put it on where you need it and just, like, blend it in. And it does work. I definitely, definitely, definitely like this product and I will continue purchasing. I got the new um, 12 hour infallible slim eye liquid liner and this is what I'm wearing on my eyes right now if you can see. Oh my gosh amazing this point is to die for it's perfect it's hard it does it's not flimsy it perfect like it's so easy to work with like I'm obsessed with this I don't really care for liquid liners I use gel liners um, but this one will repurchase over and over and over again because it's amazing. It was like eat something at Target. Wonderful. Lovely. Three lipsticks real quick. Actually two because I don't know where the other one is. Um, I got, um, I don't actually have it with me to my room, but I'm not going to grab it. It's another MAC one. I got, um, cream cup. Um, I don't have a lot of pink like really nice pinks so I got cream cup and then I got angel Ugh. the famous Kim Kardashian lipstick and it's beautiful they look really similar but I chose to keep them both and this was from um, my sister's boyfriend's gift card I got um, um was able to go to Mac and buy some lipstick and then I got another pink um because I have so many nudes I need pinks I got the new oh, a newer lipstick I think it's called pink pink cognito from Revlon and it's a very I love this color especially for like this is the everyday color and I like it it's the everyday color for me because it shows on my lips and my lips are pigmented so um I love it it's very natural um I feel like it's almost like a lip gloss because it's not too too highly pigmented but it's can barely see it I know you can barely see it but it's just it's beautiful it's a great color to have I got this necklace at H&M it was like nine dollars or twelve dollars with my gift card from um daisy from to h&m then i got this one which was 12.95 that i am obsessed with it's just a really nice gold i got um the stay flawless at uh, ulta it it's amazing i will never go to another primer it's worth every penny 32 dollars i got this tantalizer from Lorac from myra which is awesome to bronze out I got the Duo Dark Ahisa for my lashes. I'm going to start wearing lashes a little more, so I wanted to get dark. Although the L'Oreal Voluminous Moldering, um, I like it for um, when I don't want to wear gel liner or liquid liner. I will wear um, just regular, I don't know, what is this called? What kind of eyeliner is this? Like a smudging eyeliner? I don't know. 
But anyways, ugh. um, I got this when I don't want to wear liquid or gel. I will just literally draw a thin, really nice little layer line on my top lid, and then I'll just use like this really straight edged eyeliner brush and just smudge it out and it's like perfect and last three things is um i got this um duo sharpener from h&m it's for like a big uh, jumbo lip um stick or a big eyeliner um and then a small one just so i can have a duo all together when i travel these are my two new colors that i wanted to talk about I got um, soft brown finally. Well, I actually spoke about this, but these are my two new colors. Soft brown, and this is my newest color that I got with the Back to Mac program. I turned in six containers, and I got, uh, what is this called? Brown script. And I've heard so much about it, so I was like, all right, let me get it. And it's absolutely great. So, yeah. Um, and I keep it in this case that I got all together, magnetized, and it's awesome. But yeah, that's everything I have. Um, it was a lot to talk about. Obviously, I needed like another SIM card or SD card to film the rest. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Hope you get some ideas. If you have questions, just ask me. But um, I pretty much explained everything. I might definitely we'll be talking about more of the products that i got so i hope you enjoyed it and you have a great day